please put your hands together and me, help me welcome him on stage mr yogesh manwani head avod seo news and stories z5 india Do I need to label? Or am I audible? Yeah, perfect. Thanks. Sorry, guys. Good afternoon, everybody. Hi, everyone. Is everyone awake? Yeah. um uh, let me start first by actually thanking the entire uh, exchange for media team for putting together this uh, lovely conference and the second edition i think uh, these platforms allow uh, you know experts and brands to have meaningful conversations exchange thoughts ideas best practices and hopefully we go out of these inspired and go out there and innovate and solve different challenges and uh, create other innovative stuff uh, um let me start uh, first by actually uh, sharing an anecdote with you um i'm going to be talking through my thoughts that uh, we've had uh, on the shifts that are happening in uh, the ott and the digital world and how at z5 we are kind of leveraging uh, these uh, changes that are happening to help provide our consumers uh, a hyper personalized and unique experience and also work with our brand partners uh, to help them reach out to uh, their consumers and engage with their consumers um but before i i go forward i'll just share a quick uh, anecdote with you um yesterday at office uh, while having lunch at the lunch table um we were in, indulging in some after lunch banter banter with uh, some of my colleagues and there were two colleagues who were having a discussion and one of them owed uh, money to the other and uh, he asked him um you know what's your account number and uh, he gave him his account number uh, this chap he opened up his wallet Uh, typed in the account number and then uh, made the payment and the other guy confirmed that yes you know the money is in my account um that took less than 60 to 90 seconds uh i know and come to think of it if you were to do something similar uh, in possibly less than uh, just about a decade back um these things were not possible right uh, you had to go through a long process or you have to deal in cash but well, uh, currently these days obviously we can't deal in cash um and advancement in technology actually uh, and rapid advancement in technology coupled with uh, cheaper handsets cheap data has enabled this change has enabled this change at the consumer level right um consumers today have um the ability to engage with um different kinds of services right um and mobile has actually led to uh, a very big quantum jump that has happened in this consumer behavior um there is a big consumer segment which has uh, transitioned straight on to the mobile um and which is why uh, mobile first is a trend that began and i think right now it's moving to mobile only um because consumers today are doing everything uh, on the mobile uh, they are um they are, they are possibly engaging in all kinds of activities um and there are a lot of statistics that point towards these trends that are happening um i don't want to delve on many of these i'm sure uh, you guys have uh, you know gone through many of those but there are two statistics which i would want to uh, talk about uh, one is um 451 million um that's um uh, the current internet population of india um and that also happens to be um coincidentally somewhere in the ballpark range of the number of estimated smartphones in india um what's encouraging uh, and promising is that this number is represents one third of our population of the country which is about 33 to 36% um and this number is estimated to only rapidly grow 
thanks to all the barriers uh, breaking down even more. And this growth is expected to come uh, from not only the metros, but even the non-metros and even the rural market. And consumers are adopting to mobile and the internet in droves at a rapid pace. And which takes me to the second st statistic, which is 32% uh, growth, which is the number which is uh, the estimated growth rate for digital advertising in India over the next couple of years. And that's not a surprise. Uh, consumers are adopting this medium and moving on to the internet and mobile and all marketers and brand owners, uh, smart marketers and brand owners have to ad adapt and adopt uh, to where the consumers are moving and where consumer behavior is moving. Um, but with this behavior uh, comes a set of challenges. So while today consumers will be getting on to their mobile to buy movie tickets, to buy train tickets, to do banking transactions, to pay their utility bills, um, to shop online, to listen to music, um, to uh, watch their favorite shows and movies. Um, all of this is leading to a different set of challenges for marketers uh, and opportunities. Um, at Z5, uh, we have taken cognizance of those um, and we are working towards uh, you know, developing solutions along with our brand partners using technology that helps advertisers address these solutions, address these challenges, sorry. But what are the challenges, right? So I would want to talk about three of them specifically, which we believe that are very critical for every marketer today to take note of. Um, one is the changed consumer behavior and expectations. Um, technology has, uh, uh, you know, brought in convenience in the in the lives of consumers, uh, but it's also disrupted um, the traditional consumption patterns and behaviors and journeys. Uh, today, a consumer can go from awareness to consumption or purchase uh, in a split second. At, the, at a single tap or a tap of a button, right? Um, and that's something that we had never had to deal with in the past, marketers and brand owners had not to deal with. Um, consumers expect brands to understand them and treat them as individuals and understand them in a very hyper-personalized manner. The attention spans of consumers have become far lower. And if that was not enough as challenges, uh, today the consumer also has tools available specifically on the digital medium uh, that can, uh, you know, drive up high ad avoidance. And therefore in this context, you know, um, the new age marketing concepts and tools like content marketing, influencer marketing, um, these come in very handy. And these are the tools um, that kind, that marketers and brand owners need to adapt to. Um, the second challenge uh, and the advantage and the critical aspect that we should take note of in today's times is that of um, insights and insights leading to segmentation. Uh, we all are aware that digital allows brands uh, the ability uh, to have access to rich data and uh, using the right tools, working with the right partners can help these brand owners and these marketers uh, to dive deep into these insights uh, or this data and help uh, reach out to specific segments in uh, a very customized and hyper-personalized manner. It could mean um, a different creative strategy. It could mean you reach out to different consumer segments depending on who you're targeting, where you're targeting, uh, using different creative mass messages, using different creative assets. Yeah? That ability today resides uh, on the digital medium uh, and with certain specific partners. And then the third most important aspect in today's times is that of transparency and safety. So while digital brings in a lot of transparency, um, advertisers and marketers and brand owners have the ability to track their marketing investments real time, uh, tinker and tweak with 
it to ensure they get the maximum returns and the maximum bang for their buck. Um, they also need to be prudent about the choices that they make to ensure um, that the money is being invested in the right places and in a brand safe environment. So these are three critical aspects um, which today every marketer and brand owner needs to, in our opinion, uh, take note of. Uh, and these, can all, these are also uh, opportunities for brand owners to leverage um, with the right partners. Uh, at Z5, we have uh, used the latest uh, in uh, technology using AI and ML solutions. So while we do understand the power of the content and we leverage content, we believe it's important to invest in technology also to be able to deliver consumers a personalized experience and brand owners uh, also um, a very personalized solutions, right? Um, and we have uh, come up with a Z5 ad suite, which is uh, solutions, which is four bucket solutions, uh, which I'll take you through very briefly over here. Um, but all of these solutions um, have been designed using the best in technology in class to help address and leverage those three career aspects that I spoke to you about, about change consumer behavior, about inciting and segmentation, and about transparency and safety. Um, our entire ad suite rests on something called Infonomics. Infonomics is the backbone of our ad suite. It is where all the data resides. It is where uh, leveraging the rich insights, um, brand owners and marketers can create cohorts and segments and uh, do targeting and segmentation of their messaging, depending on their goals and their objectives and their brand KPIs and business KPIs. Um, they can target and segment not only on demographics, they can target and segment on device types, on interests, on affinity, and multiple other parameters. And that really is the backbone of our entire ad suite, uh, which helps all the other four offerings that we have, right, to become more effic effective and efficient. And I'll start with AdWalt on top. Um, AdWalt um, basically allows advertisers to choose from a repository uh, you know, of different uh, assets uh, that marketers and brand owners can choose to invest in um, and also buying mechanisms. So we just had a performance marketing, uh, you know, panel discussion just before. Uh, and uh, if, um, if a brand owner or marketer comes to us and leverages the AdWall solution, depending on whether you want to do a brand campaign or you want to do a performance campaign, you can choose any of the assets, whether it's video, display, masthead, and you can choose to buy uh, on various other par performance parameters also. Um, I'll take you through some of the basic cases that we have done later down the line. Then there is Amplify. Uh, this is uh, the, uh, the solution that is offered uh, for basically amplification of brand messages using the power of our content and our characters and technology. Um, Solutions like influencer marketing, content marketing, hosting branded content, live streaming, all of these various solutions um, reside under, under this particular bucket of uh, Amplify. And uh, brands can really leverage the power of our characters and help uh, boost their brand imagery um, or other brand KPIs depending on what their goals or their challenges are. Then there is Play5. Um, it's a very unique solution, again, that we offer. Um, it, it allows brands uh, to engage with their consumers uh, and interact with them. Um, and depending on what the goal or the objective is, it could be a gamification solution that you can go for. It can be a quiz, it can be a poll, it can be a survey. Um, and you can tailor it based on the segments that you wish to cater to. You can ride on any of our existing properties, or we could look at creating a, a solution for the brand depending on, again, what their goal or their challenge is. And I'll again walk you through later uh, some of the cases that we have done for some brands. Um, and then the last is Wishbox. This is, uh, this is a solution that brands can use to drive commerce, video commerce, um, and engage with consumers in the moment of truth. So the next time a consumer is um, watching his or her favorite show, um, and if he or she is interested uh, 
to buy or know more about a particular garment or an apparel or a fashion accessory that their character is wearing, you just need to click on it, um, add it to your wish list, and uh, you can click on it later and it'll take you to a store, give you the details, and you can make the purchase there and then, yeah? Um, this is a classic example of how the journey is disrupted. Uh, and like I said, just from you know, awareness to purchase uh, in the flick of a second, yeah? So these, these ad suite is really catering uh, to uh, the modern day challenges or the digital challenges that brand owners and marketers today have. Um, and backed by uh, you know, technology solutions through AI and M ML that we do uh, that help our brand um, partners to kind of address the goals, uh, the KPIs that they have for the brands or the businesses. I'll uh, quickly just take you through some of the cases uh, that we have done, um, which basically go through AdVault and Amplify, yeah? Uh, this is a solution um, which we worked out for Vivo India. Uh, the client had come to us with a brief um, just before Independence Day, and uh, they wanted uh, us to work on a content marketing solution which uh, uh, helped the brand uh, boost the imagery and the India Connect. Um, uh, they were very clear they wanted to also leverage the power of our influencers and characters. Um, and we worked with our in-house creative teams uh, and, the part, uh, and the client and the agencies. And we came up with a content marketing solution, which not only uh, was a pure content marketing solution, we also used technology for hosting this, boosting the reach, boosting the messages, uh, and also taking it on uh, social. Yeah, um, we created a unique anthem which was uh, in line with uh, s which what the brand's intended message was called Hame India. We leveraged all our characters uh, to create uh, the initial buzz around this content piece and uh, also within the content piece itself. Um, and we had very encouraging responses. We had about uh, close to 1.5 million video views and about 46 million impressions that happened on, on this. Uh, I'll just play uh, just a sample of one of the initial promotional videos that we had shot for this. I am India, you are India, we are all India. इस इंडिपेंडेंस डे को हमारी तरफ से आप सब को हार्दिक शुभकामनाएं। Catch a new song, हम हैं इंडिया, only on Z5. So like I said, we actually uh, not only created this content marketing piece, we actually uh, deployed it on the platform itself. Uh, we used our, the power of our recommendation engine. We used um, uh, an auto preview tool. Uh, we also uh, went out and uh, amplified this message on social using the power of our characters and our own platform itself. Uh, and we managed to create enough and uh, more buzz around this and deliver the brand KPIs. Uh, another example that I would want to talk to you about uh, on hosting is about uh, Chings. This was a brand um, that came to us with uh, the branded content created. And uh, the ask was simply to leverage the power of the platform to amplify uh, you know, the reach of the message. Um, and this is something that uh, we went out there and we hosted. Uh, and we not only hosted, we again amplified it using uh, our various tools like notifications and again our hosting platform and uh, uh, you know, AI and ML uh, solutions like Minutely to again boost this. We had encouraging responses on this in terms of 40 million impressions that we had. Uh, we also have worked with Bevo to do something called live streaming. The last four launches that Bevo has done, their uh, mobile phones have been live streamed on the platform. Um, the client began with us on this journey and uh, has seen encouraging responses and positive responses. So today, uh, you, your launch event doesn't necessarily need to be restricted only within the four walls within a certain set of people. Uh, you can actually leverage the power of uh, this platform and reach out to a larger segment and it can be 
a direct to consumer event that you can create which can help your brand uh, get imagery uplift and create initial buzz right from uh, day zero itself um, we've had about 9.5 million impressions that have happened on these launches that we have done with vivo uh, over the last couple of months I was talking about gamification earlier um, and um, we've done a lot of solutions. I'm sharing one with you which is right now, in fact, active and on right now. Um, there is a show called uh, Dadakiri. It's a, it's a quiz show that's aired um, on Z Bangla, uh, hosted by Saurav Ganguly. Um, and Colgate had uh, come to us and we were in conversations with them and they have a proposition um, which encourages people to smile more. Um, and we created this solution for them where uh, we created a game and when you interact and you're playing with the game, depending on how you either scoring well or even if you're not scoring well, uh, there is a contextual messaging of Colgate. It's not just pure branding, but there's a contextual messaging of Colgate that comes in. Uh, every day we have millions of people who come on the platform and engage and interact uh, with this game uh, who are exposed to this message. Uh, and again, this is a great example of contextual messaging which completely uplifts the brand KPIs. Uh, this is uh, a case that came to us for Dettol. Um, they were uh, launching a mom-approved campaign. Um, the target audience was very clearly um, you know, mothers. And uh, the, the, their goal was to uh, go deeper into the various regions and uh, get uh, drive connected engagement for their message uh, in these specific regions. Um, we leverage the power of our characters across all the regions um, and some of the stuff I'll share with you is Marathi and Hindi um, and we created uh, concepts which were around the influence of marketing and social marketing uh, you know uh, platforms um, which helped the brand get the Philip uh, beyond the classical messaging that they had created and were plastering across mediums. Oh my god! Hey, data also product hai. We hai expect us not to get up. Maddie is surprised. Thank you so much, data. For us, cook chan product hai. Manjay Malata, today put the thing in a compromise for our lagan. I mean, my family said he ate them suitable. The data also product hai. Manjay and the 100% protection. I'll just quickly take you through another video which was in Hindi for this. Um, the big advantage, uh, you know, was this. We actually created a two-phase campaign. We had a teaser and then we had a reveal and what I'm sharing with you is the reveal. And the big advantage is the characters that we utilized in this had already enjoy a very strong connect with consumers and they have enjoy a certain equity which went in uh, very well uh, with what the brand's intended, you know, uh, imagery uh, goals were, yeah. So we had very high completion rates on this and we got about 5.8 million impressions and you know solutions like this help us, uh, help brands navigate the issues of ad, ad widens and uh, clutter breaking. Uh, the last one I'm going to leave you with is uh, in a similar direction. This is for a brand called Asian Paints that we did. Uh, the brand had created a campaign themselves um, and uh, 
they had a creative idea and a thought uh, and positioning uh, that they had already done. Um, we uh, went worked with the brand uh, to create uh, a creative solution um, which was communicating the same message but leveraging again the, again the power of our characters and our influencers. Um, we started on this journey with the brand and initially it was uh, going to be just a 10 day activity um, but it's got such and only purely on our platform um, but the results were so encouraging that uh, it's still continuing on on the platform and therefore i don't have the results to share with you at the moment um, and in fact the client has taken this even outside of the platform on other mediums <laughs> ऐसे देता है क्या कोई रोज? पहले तो आप बहुत रोमांटिक थे। याद कीजे पहले। वक्त बदला पर दीवारों की शाइन में। so that's that's what I have and before I sign off uh, just want to reinforce the message saying that while digital uh, comes with a lot of opportunities it also comes with a lot of challenges and I think marketers and brand owners need to leverage the power of content and technology and work with the right partners uh, to help amplify their brand messages and deliver their brand KPIs and their business KPIs. And we at Z5 are always happy uh, for brands to throw challenges at us. So uh, please come work with us. Uh, we are happy to engage, collaborate uh, and do innovation and uh, celebrate success. And uh, for all those who have been nominated for this evening's uh, awards, a big congratulations to each one of you. And I hope uh, you guys enjoy your evening today. Thank you.